Introduction Both Android and Apple phones are predominant mobile devices in the current market of smartphones, which possess several key characteristics and features. Although there are many points of similarities between them, it is evident that a potential consumer needs to be able to distinguish the overall advantages and disadvantages when considering purchasing either iPhones or Android alternatives. However, one of the most distinctive features of Apple products is its increased safety measures, whereas Android provides more efficient battery usage. Security Today, the most common operating system for mobile devices is Android. The first version of the operating system was released in 2008, after which there were several system updates, which are used by most manufacturers of smartphones and tablets. Android OS is based on the Linux kernel. In addition to smartphones and tablets running Android devices, such as ebooks, netbooks, watches, and TVs, it is important to consider the fact that most people never face the problem of viruses because they do not go beyond the Play Store to install applications. Specific manufacturers, such as Samsung, have taken additional measures to improve security in the enterprise market. Nonetheless, the slow manner of updates on many Android devices can adversely affect important security fixes. Fast updates are more important now than ever because security breaches are becoming more serious. Android lags behind in terms of updates and is, therefore, less secure. Since millions of Android phones are still running software that has been around for several years, they could be vulnerable to such serious hacks. Moreover, the gadgets on the iOS platform are difficult to infect with a virus or disable out of ignorance. Cloud data storage, automatic backup saving is major aspect of iPhones, where the first option allows file sharing on all Apple devices, and the second will protect against the loss of all user data in case of breakage or theft of the gadget. Apple is already firmly rooted in America's corporate world, working to improve security for ordinary consumers, in particular by implementing Touch ID and Face ID in the iPhone X and later smartphones. Apple's close monitoring of applications and the ability to send updates to more devices more quickly gives it a definite edge over Android. The company also encrypts data in iMessage and other applications. Apple gives priority to user privacy, so the client may feel secure knowing that his or her personal data is not stored or gathered by Apple. Meanwhile, Android only encrypts some data, and user privacy is less secure. Google collects customer data for information that it can use to deliver better ads to the client. This data is also stored and read in order to develop artificial intelligence. In addition, Google obliges to fully protect user privacy and continue to provide artificial intelligence services. Still, it is evident that Google, where the overall business model is based on collecting data, presents a false choice between AI and privacy. Battery Battery life is the most important factor for smartphone owners. Comparing both operating systems is difficult since they work on different hardware. It is important to state that iOS is optimized to squeeze the maximum out of one more charge, but one can also purchase such a device on Android with a more powerful battery that can easily outlast the iPhone. In both Android and iOS, the user can view battery usage statistics for each application, but only Android will show how much longer your battery will last. Both operating systems offer an energy-saving mode that can increase the battery life cycle, but it's all much easier to set up on Android. Moreover, as for charging devices, Android devices have long been leaders, as many have been equipped with a quick and wireless charge feature. However, the iPhone 8, 8 Plus, and iPhone 10 have also implemented these features, and now they are in all new generation iPhones. It is worth noting that the adapter for a quick charge for the iPhone needs to be bought separately, while for Android, it is usually provided upon purchase. This category is far from ambiguous, but if one compares the Android and iPhone for the same price, the former often differ in more durable batteries and adapters for a quick charge when buying, so Android is better in this regard. Conclusion 
In conclusion, it is important to point out that both Android and Apple phones possess a number of similarities regarding the basic smartphone features, and their choice is solely dependent on a consumer's personal needs and taste. However, there are key similarities that need to be factored in when considering Android and Apple phones. The critical characteristic of Apple devices is their overall safety from any form of malware and data leakage due to the effective measures undertaken by the company. In the case of Android devices, one needs to acknowledge the fact that the battery life of such phones is more reliable regarding the length of active use. You can find this and many other essay samples on our website studycorgi.com.